We'll go here and then there. Blake, you're fantastic. That was a great answer. As President of the United States, will you recognize the personhood of the unborn child under Amendment 14 and 5? So, unborn life is life. That is what I stand for. I don't wish to apologize for my perspective. I am unapologetically pro-life. And the reality is, this doesn't have to be so divisive, guys. It really doesn't. I, I will, I'll give you a challenge. It'll just say we can get back to national unity. There's a case, Clarence Thomas brought it up, pregnant woman walking down the street, the unborn child dies as a result of an assault. I can't find one American in this country who will say that that criminal does not deserve liability for that death. What does that say? We share these instincts in common. And for my part, I will walk the walk. Here's what I'll say. We can have a conversation about paths to adoption, to child care, to greater sexual responsibility for men in an era of paternity tests. So I will walk the walk. But this isn't about men's or women's rights. It's about human rights. We have to all be in this together. That's where I land on it.